having a mixing valve above your water heater as well as shower control faucets that are mixing that have that mixing op uh, like application you end up tempering the water twice <laughs> Good morning or afternoon, I'm not sure right now. Good people. Rafi Konsker here, Preferred Plumbing Solutions. Hope you're all doing well. I wanna share with you guys an interesting concept, a quick tip, okay? Um, if you are noticing that the water in your home, the hot water in your home is just not as hot or after a while is um, kind of tapering off so let's say it's hot for a few minutes but then as you continue showering or using the water you notice it's getting cooler and you're finding yourself having to turn the water hotter on your faucet or whatnot um, it doesn't necessarily mean that your water heater is wearing out I mean it could be depending on the age but it doesn't necessarily mean that and it may not be it could it may or may not be the specific plumbing fixture at hand whether it's a shower control faucet or whatever it could be that you have what's called a mixing valve above your water heater. Many homes have mixing valves. And what a mixing valve is, it's there to temper the water. So as the whole hot water comes out of your tank, cold water gets mixed into it to temper the water. Now, when those start to fail, which they do quite frequently, and the number one cause for failure is scale, like lime scale, like the hardness in the water, the calcium, lime scale, magnesium, falls out of solution, it gets stuck in the screens and in the check stops and other little components and divots of the mixing valve. Um, you'll get, you can get what's called crossover, where cold and hot kind of cross over each other. You'll also sometimes find that too much cold water enters the hot system, uh, the hot part of the di distribution piping, sorry. So um, feel, the, feel the pipe with your hand carefully coming out of the water heater, kind of get a feeling of what that temperature is, and then feel the pipe coming out of the mixing valve. If it's far cooler than what it is coming out of the water heater, then you know your mixing valve either needs adjustment or has failed and needs to be either replaced or removed altogether. Because the real issue, and the reason why Ontario Plumbing Code put that code requirement in was for is for people, and more specifically for children, not to scald themselves. But the shower controls, the showers are where children used to scald themselves, you know, in, back in the day. But now shower systems are no longer two handle showers where the hot and cold are separate handles. So there's no opportunity for a child to just turn on just the hot side and get, and God forbid, burn themselves. They are single lever controls, whether they're thermostatic systems or pressure balancing systems. But either way, it's mixing the water already and there's one lever that you have to rotate. So it's a lot more difficult to scald yourself. So having a mixing valve above your water heater as well as shower control faucets that are mixing that have that mixing op, uh, like application, you end up tempering the water twice. So keep that in mind. Um, obviously we can give you some options. We can come out and help you. But I just wanna give you guys a head start to kind of figure out what's happening there. All right guys, I love you all. Rafi Preferred Plumbing, God bless you. Have a nice day. Stay positive.